our group will present one way ANOVA between group by using SPSS. Now, let's see the question. A teacher would like to know the best teaching method that can be used to teach topic trigonometry. The students are randomly divided into three different groups based on different teaching methods. After finish the topic, a test was given to the students and their marks are shown on the next slide. An alpha equals to 0.05 test the claim that there is a significant difference among the means. The table shows the marks for three different groups based on three different methods. There is method 1, method 2 and method 3. So now we want to know whether there is a difference among the mean between these three methods. The hypotheses are as below. H null, mu1 equals to mu2 equals to mu3 and H1, at least one mean is different from the others and the claim is at H1. So test the claim at alpha equals to 0 0.05. Now, I will show you step by step on how to find the difference among the means using SPSS. First of all, we must key in the data one by one. The first column shows the subject for the experiment which is equal to 30. The second column shows the method which is method 1, method 2 and also method 3. And the last column shows the marks for the test. Then click analyze compare means and choose one way ANOVA. Select marks as the dependent list and method as a factor. For one way ANOVA, we need to choose post hoc test because if we reject HNAL, we need to do multiple comparison to find where is the difference. So in this case, choose to key test, select continue and then OK. Now let's see the ANOVA table. The significant value is 0.001, which is less than 0.05, so we reject H0. That means there is a difference among the means, so we have to do multiple comparison. Now, let's see the multiple comparison result. The significant value for method 1 and method 2 is 0.01, which is less than 0.05, so we reject H0. The significant value for method 1 and method 3 is 0.348 which is greater than 0.05 so we do not reject H0. And significant value for method 2 and method 3 is 0.025 which is less than 0.05 so we reject H0. The conclusion is there is the difference between method 1 and method 2 and also the difference between method 2 and method 3. So that's all.